Dr. Pradyumna Mijra talking to us on. Uh, Hello, good morning everyone. Today I'll be speaking on modified mustaries, our approach of lower eyelid reconstruction at a tertiary healthcare center. Surgically, eyelids can be divided into the anterior lamella comprising of the skin and the orbicularis oculi and posterior lamella which comprises of the conjunctiva, tarsus and the eyelid retractors. Both lamella usually require reconstruction and full thickness defect. So mustaries uh, rotation flap is uh, often employed for wider and uh, deeper lower eyelid defects which involves more than two-thirds of the uh, eyelids. Mustardi in 1971 uh, uh, used this procedure to construct both the anterior and the posterior lam lamella and the frequent uh, complications were downward contra uh, contraction and sagging of the flap and ectropion of the lid margin whereas Callahan in 1980 modified it to prevent these complications by saying that the gigomatico cheek flap must be carefully designed, rotated and sutured as high as possible so that the palpebral fissure is only a narrow slit postoperatively. So basic principles which uh, are uh, uh, needed to know for flaps, uh, flap and graft. A graft can be laid on a flap, a flap can be laid on a flap but a graft cannot be uh, laid on a, another graft because of lack of blood supply. So this is the Masadis technique. In this first we have to uh, mark the tumor along with uh, 3 to 4 millimeter clear margins on either side on either and on both the medial and the lateral aspect then from the medial aspect of the uh, 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 extended line we uh, move uh, uh, downwards uh, towards the uh, cheek uh, with uh, and the height of the this line is should be two third of the base of the triangle and then we uh, uh, join the lateral angle of the then we join the lateral angle of the uh, tumor mark and uh, we join it to the tip of this uh, triangle then uh, from this we from the uh, from the lateral canthus we uh, raise the we mark the uh, incision uh, line uh, uh, superiorly and temporarily and then we curve it downwards towards the ear lobe then the flap is raised in the submucosal plane and the flap is rotated and sutured alternately using 40 uh, silk and uh, 60 vicro purpose to study the outcomes of mustardis cheek rotation flap in lower lid uh, reconstruction to achieve near normal uh, eyelid. Uh, total of 18 uh, patients underwent uh, mo modified uh, cheek, uh, mustardis cheek rotation flap including diagnosis, post-op complication and surgical out outcomes. Uh, mustardis flap was done in case with basal cell carcinoma, squamous cell carcinoma, sebaceous cell carcinoma, melanin, all of which involved the lower eyelid. So this is the case one. Uh, in which the patient presented with a nodular ulcerative lesion which was excised and uh, the lid defect was uh, repaired using the Masadi's uh, cheek rotation flap. This is a post-op uh, uh, second week image. The biopsy came out to be basal cell carcinoma. This is a case of uh, mebumin uh, gland carcinoma involving the lower lid and this is the post-op image of uh, the same uh, two weeks later. So this is another case of uh, mebumin uh, gland uh, involvement in which the patient underwent uh, cutler beard uh, uh, for the upper lid uh, mebumin gland involvement followed by the patient came uh, with uh, the lower lid mebumin gland carcinoma and patient underwent this uh, mustardis cheek rotation flap. Result, uh, there was good uh, eyelid coverage and eyelid support. There was no skin necrosis or atropion uh, observed. In two cases, a lower position of the free edge of the new eyelid was noticed after the edema subside without any important functional impairment. All the patient had an acceptable degree of rigidity and immobility of the new eye. Uh, the, the scar which remained was uh, atrophy, uh, had a uh, fat atrophy. However, the eyelid closure was not affected since the upper eyelid were functional and slightly totic. Uh, the modified mustardis, it uh, ensures good coverage and uh, satisfactory functional and aesthetic result in case of large uh, full thickness uh, defect of the lower eyelid. And modified mustardis, even after uh, more than 40 years of uh, uh, history, remains the most vers vers versatile method. Thank you. Thank you very much. It was a very nice presentation. Thanks.